Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. I'm Rayanne, and today I will be talking about the terror at Blood Fart Lake. Never thought I'd say those words all in one sentence. Uh, it is a 2009 movie. It's directed by Chris Siever. The movie involves a walking stereotypical of all different stereotypes, college kids, that come to their friend's lake house on a school break while they discuss a local legend that may or may not just be a ghost story and then the happenings from there so my likes the methods in which people are dispatched are super creative there is always humorous elements present pretty much no matter what's going on in the movie and this might actually be the first movie that i've seen a killer wield corn cobs as weapons so that was definitely interesting. I enjoyed that. The references to all different sorts of horror movies, particularly uh, 80s slasher movies, were awesome. It really made me feel like this movie was kind of a love letter to the genre and definitely to the fans. So I felt like it was this inside joke that I was also a part of because I was like, oh, I get that reference too. Like all these references I would make. And I really enjoyed that. So with this director, it seems like there's a theme to have a very entertaining dialogue that's full of sexuality, sexual references, body functions, as well as running jokes and seeing more and more of his work. I feel like I'm kind of included in the jokes, which is fun, and the dialogue still is pretty gross, but very, very well thought out, and I appreciate that. Um, my dislike. At first, I didn't quite get the correlation between the one owner of Fright Rags being portrayed in the movie, so I was a little bit confused at first, and then when I kind of looked into it more, it made sense. They did give special thanks to the movie, and it did kind of prompt me to go check out Fright Rags website because I hadn't been there in a bit so that worked uh, I do give the movie a four out of five I did really enjoy it I felt like it was a really good satire of 80s kind of camp or cabin based slasher movies and I was consistently entertained I found this on Amazon video it, it you are able to find a physical copy but again with some of the more not well-known movies it's harder and harder nowadays which makes me sound so old to find dvd copies because once they're out of print they're kind of just gone so you have to really track them down which can be a pain but who doesn't have prime though prime is amazing i know i've said that a few times but i love prime so have you guys seen the movie what did you think about it did you get the same you know satisfaction like i said with a lot of the director's other work, I got a really trauma vibe out of it. And I really like trauma, so I really enjoyed it. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Please like the video if you did enjoy it. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'd love to have you. And hit the bell for all notifications of my uploads. You can also find me on Facebook, Reanimator Reviews, and Twitter at Reanimator. And enjoy the terror at Blood Fart Lake.